Okay, what's up everybody? Uh, today we're going to do the second Big Larry tutorial. I had filmed another one and then took it down because I realized it was kind of a leap from where the first tutorial will leave you off and um, I realized that I need to go at a slower pace. So today we're going to talk about kind of an in-between set of tricks called two finger wraps and uh, and then one finger wraps so um, for the two finger wrap you can't do them in top grip so you're gonna want to get into high grip and uh, pretty much just tuck your index and ring finger in not index and ring pinky and ring and uh, when you do your slip you're just gonna stick your fingers back out let the let the beads let the bead wrap around uh, your fingers like that. Um, there's not too much I can say about this. This is actually the first trick I, I figured out on my own when I was uh, first starting out. And you don't have to actually add a slip in between, you can just let it go. And, uh, maybe you can catch a rhythm there. Uh, I like to do a slip in between because it just, this is pretty much my. Uh, pick up and start doing this is the first thing I do when I pick up the beads uh, so you can actually do that in a, pretty much any grip you like it's a little weird here you know uncomfortable maybe especially down here it's it's the weirdest so um, moving on uh, one finger wraps are the same concept once you have two finger wraps down instead of letting the string wrap around your fingers on this upswing you're gonna want to just uh, stick your pinky or your uh, index out like that and let the bead wrap around it uh, so in full speed like that so now once you're here you can let it go down and go back into your two finger wrap and then uh, on the downswing, you can do your bottom finger. Here it's the middle finger. And then you got a little back and forth going. And this can be done in, in any grip as well. So, um, so or that, not like that. That was wrong. Because I, I, when you when you um, if you go on an upward swing on your down downward finger it won't catch on your fingers, if you can see what I'm saying there. So uh, here on the pinky wrap, it looks like that. So those are two finger and one finger wraps. And uh, I guess a quick third trick here to add to your flow, since we're talking about kind of a wrap position, is a little, little wrist twist. Uh, if you can see that. So for that, on this downward swing, as the bead is going on the downward stroke, just move your hand outward and kind of go from here to there, right? Here to there. Because once it's here, it's going to swing like that and then you bring it back so you get this little I don't even know what to call this it's a twirl or a you know maybe if you're a pen spinner it can be considered a wiper kind of move and uh, it can actually be done both ways and this is another one that can be done in any grip so Um, and yeah, grip transfer I didn't cover in, in the first tutorial that's pretty useful is uh, coming from top to low behind your back, the back of your hand like that, and then back. So for that one, you just, as you swing the beads forward, I'm going to stick your pinky out and let the, uh, the bead fall right in between that. and. Uh, it might even click together and that's a, that'll kind of push this guy out and then you're down here in low grip 
and you can just go back and forth like that. So, uh, hope you guys learned something from this. Um, those of you who are good at playing with Bigleri, I, I encourage you to make tutorials of your own since I'm running out of tricks. And uh, yeah, have a good one, guys.